We use the term robbing to describe several conditions, all of which mean that there are things that have honey or are covered in honey that the bees are eagerly cleaning up. For example, when we cut the caps off of honey frames, we end up with honey sticky wax. We don't waste the honey. We put the wax outside by the beehives and the bees will go crazy robbing all the honey off the wax. They are so thorough that the leftover wax flakes will be completely clean and dry and no longer sticky. Then we can melt that wax to make candles or other things. Once we empty the honey out of the drawn honeycombs in the frames, they are super sticky as well, and we will put them out for the bees to lick clean and dry. If it's the end of the season, fall, once they are dried and clean, we will store the honey boxes until next year. Another form of robbing is not a good one, and that is if a hive has become very weak, it usually means their queen has died and they've been unsuccessful in making a new queen and their population has significantly decreased. The hive will have honey, but not enough workers to stop other bees from coming into the hive and stealing it. If other beehives find a weak hive, they will send foragers into that hive to steal the weak hive's honey. We don't usually want this type of robbing to happen, so we will make some changes. We will put an entrance reducer, which will make the entrance to the hive very tiny so that it doesn't take many bees to protect and guard it. We will also purchase a queen from a queen breeder and introduce her to the hive as soon as possible in order to get the population building again. If they don't have much in honey stores, they can be fed sugar water. When it comes to honey, bees are great cleaner uppers.